Facade. What is going on guys, it's your boy Jacob here at Warface Tika. We are back with a brand new video. As you guys know, I got a new tattoo, I had some traveling and it fucked up my sleeping schedule and I started feeling a little bit sick, so I just wanted to take a few days off, chill, relax, and I've actually started to play some CS. So for all of you guys that want to see CS gameplay, I will be uploading Counter-Strike very, very soon. Today's video is not only going to be me trying Swedish Fish for the first time, because as you guys know, when I made my video the other day of the face I was trying some Swedish candy, a lot of people said, hey, you should definitely try the Swedish fish because I said in a video that I've never tried it before and apparently it's made in Canada Don't ask me why but apparently Swedish fish is made in Canada. Does that make any sense y'all? I want to show you guys my brand new tattoo, but before I do that Please click the top link in the description go follow my man Eric for always hooking me up with some insane tattoos He really deserves it. Tell him your boy Tico sent you give him a little like or a comment on any of the pictures You may like or possibly even give him a follow Honestly, one of the ones that I see is as some of the best tattoo artists out there that I've seen and for my personal preference What I like but yeah over to my tattoo. I'm very very happy about it once again It's far from finished. It's still healing and it's still darker So that's why it doesn't look too good with this one because there's a slight difference in the color But that's because it's brand new obviously and I love it even more after like a month or two months, it looks perfect in my opinion because it's way smoother and it's not as hard, dark or whatever, which fits better on my skin color in my opinion. But yeah, I'm super happy about it, but there's a lot to be added to it. It's far from finished, but I'm absolutely loving how my arm is starting to look and I can't wait to get more ink. Next time I will be doing the inside right here and will almost be finished with my arm. I still got smaller things to add to basically make it more as a full sleeve, obviously. But as I said, I wanna get the big pieces out and then work around them and finish them up and touch them up. But I'm super happy about it. And I'm getting more tattoo done in November out in LA, I think. And hopefully we'll be in the LA face house by then. I might have just teased you guys a little bit, but yeah. And now talking about the tattoos, make sure to give Eric a little follow, like, comment, whatever you may wanna do, or just go and check out his stuff. He's an amazing tattoo artist, amazing guy. Love working with him, he's an just, all around awesome dude. Over to the Swedish fish that's made in Canada. What the fuck is that? What's that? How is this made in Canada? Made in Canada. No offense. I like Canadians. I like rain. I like Nikon. I like hugs. You know? I like my Canadians. But what? I've never had Swedish fish. Isn't that kind of ridiculous? I've actually never had. I'm not making this as some kind of parody of like. Doug Sensor Mario and Face Sensor, you know, because he's like never had any kinds of foods and he makes these kind of video when he first tries it, but I've actually never had it. So I guess we'll just try it. I know it's not some intense food eating kind of video, but I wanted to do it because I've generally never had Swedish fish. Not my style. They put this in a... <laughs> I just dropped. Did they really put this in an Oreo? I saw Jev make a video about that and he like tweeted the thing. But did they really put this in an Oreo? There's no way it's good in an Oreo. It's not bad, but it's like not my kind of candy. Nah. It's not bad. It's really not bad, but... It's just not my kind of candy. It's not my kind of candy to like buy if I'm trying to like have a movie night or like play some games. You guys know I'm more of like a chocolate kind of guy. I prefer M&M's, Kit Kats, that kind of stuff, but not bad, but I wouldn't buy it as of like actually eating the candy. It wasn't bad, but you know, nothing too great. Probably because it was made in Canada. If this was actually made in Sweden, which would make total sense, it would probably taste a lot better. But now the fucking Canadians made it, like trying to rip us off and like use our name for something. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Shout out to Canadians for making Swedish fish. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this small little video. I'll be back with a proper video tomorrow. Probably gonna vlog the whole day, trying to make something epic for you guys. Or if I get a CS gameplay tonight, that'll be out tomorrow. If you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like. It always helps out a ton. Leave a comment below if there's anything else you want me to try or if there's anything else you would want me to buy and have the face house try or taste. If there's any Swedes out there, any kind of Swedish candy you would want me to give to the Face House members, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Once again, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll be back with a brand new video tomorrow. Peace out. Facade.